I thought, well, I can make this thing which is a kind of temporary monument to labor. I really could go back to my old pictures, you know, over the last seven years or so and pull things that would work, you know. So I was thinking about portraits, European workers, time I'd spent in France. And, and I was also thinking about very old forms of work, things like grape harvesting and seafaring, you know, but new ones as well, like the a machinist, you know. And then I knew I was being invited to do something with Documenta. And I had these strong memories of the, the cascade here in the Berg Park. And, and the, of course, the figure of Hercules is also a figure of, of labor. He's almost like the, exem the exemplary worker of classical Greek and mythology carried over into the Roman tradition. So I'm thinking about Hercules, and um, I'm also thinking about this, this, uh, these steps here and the, the sort of moral, baroque moral challenge of climbing the steps or being lazy, which is like the choice of Hercules, you know. Does he choose in indolence and hedonism or does he choose hard work? And my experience in the last document was such that I, I really wanted this time to be outside. I like the idea of the work being free for people. So I made some proposals about being outside and then increasingly my focus returned to the, to the Berg Park and this, this downward slope here. And uh, so I thought about refiguring the project for here, you know, because it's a it's like this portable monument to labor, which I think is the only way you can even think of a monument to labor now, because capital is mobile. So the only appropriate monument to labor has to be portable, because labor will move. I mean, it goes to Vietnam, goes to China, goes to you know uh, Mexico. Any monument to labor is like a, a nomadic uh, structure, um, and and so that's part of the idea.